Warnings about toppling TVs have been going out for years, yeah. and child care centers in our area say they are aware of the risks. News Channel 9's James Torres went to one daycare to see how they are trying to prevent these types of tragedies from happening. James. Josh, Latricia, the U.S. Consumer and Product Safety Commission launched a program called Anchor It, an educational campaign to help with ideas on how to prevent tip overs from hurting children. And child care centers in our area showed us today how they stay prepared. Get on top before your children do. That's the message from the U.S. Consumer Product Safety Commission to parents and those who watch their children. Daycare centers like the one Monique Staples owns in Chattanooga are fully aware of the dangers of tip over accidents for one good reason. Because children are children and they're going to climb. They're, that's what they do. So you have to make sure that the furniture and the items that you purchase are very secure. Um, that are safety. Safety is first for the children. At the Athens daycare, police say the TV was strapped in, but only to a rolling TV cart and not to a wall. That simple step, safety specialists at Erlinger's Children's Hospital say could have saved a child's life, and that's regardless of the weight or design of the TV. To be quite honest, what we hear from our families when we educate us, I never really thought about it. I thought when I got the flat screen, it was so much safer. Uh, I didn't think about the fact that it's on that small base and could tip over so easily. And just to give you an idea of how dangerous tip over accidents can be, some small piece of furniture like this can get knocked over really easily. One of the best ways to keep your children safe is to have your televisions mounted high and tight. Though stabilizing your furniture is essential to a child's safety, Staples says good supervision and direction are always important. So we just redirect them and let them know that we don't climb on the furniture or we don't climb up on things. Now, just a point of clarification, the daycare, the daycare center we spoke to today in Chattanooga is called Kids Corner and is not at all affiliated with the Athens Center where the accident happened. That center's name is Kitty Corner. Latricia. James, thank you. If you would like any tips on how to make sure your home is safe against furniture tip overs, you can visit our website, newschannel9.com.